What? Welcome to Ranger Reviews, the web series we look at episodes of the TV show Power Rangers and then discuss them. Today we're exploring the 22nd episode of the show Power Rangers Lost Galaxy, as well as the 315th episode overall, titled An Evil Game. We start this episode on the Scorpion Stinger, while Deviat is seeing Kegler and Singwingers moving the cocoon. Deviat loses his mind about it and sees chains are all around the cocoon. He was acting on Trakina's orders, who walks in, and Deviat changes tune right away. Trakina says she's powerful enough without it, but she'll keep it around just in case. Kegler moves it out again, and Deviat clearly has a scheme. Trakina looks at her staff, and she remembers how her dad died. Cool. Villamax comes in, saying that he's located the Red Ranger. Trakina demands that he's brought to her no matter what. She wants him to pay. In a warehouse, Deviat is by himself, pissed that Trakina showed back up. Then, two monsters come in, and Deviat shows them gold, saying that he has problems that he needs them to handle. They ask who it is, and Deviat says it's Trakina. If they finish the job, the treasure is theirs. Then Kegler comes in. Wait, are we actually on the Scorpion Stinger still? Kegler says Trakina wants Deviat to help Villamax with the Red Ranger, and he's pissed at first, but then he agrees. In a forest, Kai and Leo are sparring, and this is really cool to see. They talk shit to each other a bit before they get blasted at and knocked down. They turn around to find Villamax, who is walking up. Leo asks who he is, and he introduces himself, saying that he's loyal to Trakina. Leo and Kai morph in a cool way, running toward him, and they flip over. Now it's a Rangers versus Villamax, and the Rangers are not doing so hot. Kai in particular, not doing great. Leo tries to hold his own against Villamax, and Kai calls for help, which makes Villamax fire on him real good. Leo flips away as best he can, but then he's slashed out again. He and Villamax do some mid-air stuff, but Leo is down. Divya is then there, and he has Kai. Also, Stingwingers are there with the others, including Mike, all in chains. Villamax says that Trakina wants the Red Ranger, and if he comes with them, they'll free the others. If he doesn't, everyone's gonna die. Leo puts his sword down, and Kai tells him not to do it. Leo powers down, taking off his morpher, tossing it. Okay, no one asked you to do that. Singwingers get the Quasar Saber and the Transmorpher. Villamax tells them to take him away, and they teleport out. Villamax turns around, saying that since they got the Red Ranger, here's your freedom. He tosses Kai onto the ground, and Deviat's like, uh, we're really letting them go? And Villamax says that he gave his word, so he must honor his promise. Villamax says it's time to return to Jakina, and Deviat bitches following him. They all teleport out. Leo's all tied up, and Deviat has the saber and the morpher, saying that they should just kill Leo. Deviat fires on him, but Villamax stops him. He says Drakina wants to deal with him herself, and then she comes in, telling them to get out of her way. She says how Leo killed her dad, and Leo said he had no choice because he would have destroyed Terra Venture. Drakina says that when he killed Scorpius, he made something even more powerful. Her. She makes a lava cavern in the floor somehow, and then tells the Stingwingers to untie Leo and toss him in. I feel like this would go through the floor of the scorpion stinger, but okay. Jakina says that if she kills the Red Ranger, she'll really have notoriety. Leo tries to get free, but then he ends up falling in with Stingwingers, who cowardly zoom out with his wings, but then Leo is actually holding onto him. He grabs Deviat to get his stuff back, and they get outside, letting Deviat go. Leo has his saber and morpher, letting him run away. Deviat says, This was all his trap? What? Villamax and the Stingwingers come out, and Deviat tells them to go the wrong way. Jakina then comes out, and she asks where Leo went and he tells her the truth. She will take care of this. Deviat calls out his two monster friends from earlier. Leo is walking, and he's by some boxes, which apparently create a force field. Jakina says that this time, they're gonna kill each other or whatever. Leo then rips off his shirt for absolutely no reason whatsoever than to start a sexual awakening in all the young girls and gay boys everywhere. Morphing. The two circle around each other, and Jakina does pretty well, kicking Leo into the force field. He then hops over her, continuing the sword fight, but again, he's on the ground. In the mega ship, Mike has found the Scorpion Stinger, giving the coordinates to the others who are actually in their jet jammers. Drakina is winning, saying how her dad would be proud. Deviat is nearby, telling his two monster friends to go kill Drakina, but make it look like the Red Ranger did it. Drakina and Leo are still fighting, and Drakina really is kicking his ass. He's on the ground, and Drakina says that this is the end for him, getting closer. Then, Deviat fires on the boxes, stopping the force field. The two monsters jump down, attacking Drakina suddenly, and they refuse to tell her who they are. They're attacking hardcore, and Drakina is struggling a bit. Leo is just nearby, watching, but then he gets some sense, running away. Drakina knocks down both of the monsters, energizing her sword, killing one of them. She then takes on the other monster, pinning him. She asks who put him up to this, and just as the monster is about to say it, he's hit by an energy blast, blowing up. We see that Deviat actually sent the blast. He hobbles over, and Drakina is pissed that she was about to figure out who the traitor was, and Deviat says that he was just trying to save her life. Drakina then realizes that Leo's gone, and she's pissed. They find him falling down over and over again onto the ground, but then more explosions are around them. Here come the other rangers, and he says he's better now that the others are there. Drakina fires on them with her staff, knocking them down into the ground. She gets ready to really fire, but then the last monster that got killed by Deviat is now giant for no reason, which makes Drakina and Deviat teleport away, pissed off. 
The Rangers call out the Galactic Beasts forming the Galaxy Megazord. They immediately punch the dude in the face, and then they just blow him up with the Condor Zord. The Rangers are back on the ground, and Leo feels lucky that they found him. Then Drakina lightnings in, saying that it may not be today, but she's going to make them pay for killing her father. She will rule the world as an evil person or whatever, bye. The Rangers claim they'll be ready for her when she comes back. On the Scorpion Singer, Villamax goes to Deviat, giving him something as a token of appreciation for coming to Drakina's aid and all. It's a small dagger. Deviat agrees, saying that they have a code of honor, so it makes sense. Villamax leaves, and Deviat talks to himself evilly. And Kegler is secretly watching as Deviat bends the dagger and tosses it away, saying that loyalty means nothing. Kegler watches on. The end. This is actually a pretty decent episode. We get some story progress with Drakina now taking over as the new queen of evil or whatever, and Deviat versus Villamax is heating up. I mean, Deviat even tried to kill Drakina in this episode, but it didn't work. The only thing that's really confusing is why those two monsters things just like blatantly attacked her instead of making it look like Leo did it, like they were told to do. Oh well. Also, where are the other rangers? Did Damon, Maya, and Kendricks all take sick days? I'd like to see them a lot more. So what will happen next? Find out next time, but until then, may the power protect you.